Hey friends, welcome to Tammy's house. Today I have a flea market haul and a little thrift haul and a little tiny Walmart thing that I got that I want to show you. I am filming in a different place. This is my living room. There's my coffee bar in my dining room back there. And I'm just trying to move around a little bit. Maybe y'all like it. I don't know. Well, we'll just get started. <laughs> We're gonna start with the flea market haul. I went with friends, me and my husband did, to eat. And we went to Prattville, Alabama, and we went to a flea market called The Pickers. So we got to do some shopping before we went to a restaurant called The Catfish House. And it was so good, it was good, y'all. But anyway, I'm gonna start with this. I got this for my mother at the flea market. They have booths where individuals sell items. And she does apples in her kitchen. And so I got this apple for her to use as decor. Now, it was supposed to have been two, and these are salt shakers. But I couldn't find the other one, so I just went ahead and bought this one. It was like $2.99. But I thought she would love it and could use it as some decor. So I got that for her. I found this dish towel that this, I assume, lady makes. And... She crochets the top, and it has a loop, and then it has a button right there. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> My throat is so dry. But anyway, she crochets the top, and she puts a dish towel on it. And you can put this over your stove or cabinet to dry your hands on. So I thought this one was so pretty. I seem to be obsessed with the 40s now, the 1940s. And I wanted something that looked really old fashioned. And my friend with me told me that she thought this looked real old fashioned. So I got this, I'm gonna hang it on my stove and hopefully I'm not going to, uh, you know, wipe my hands on it too much. It's just gonna be for decor. But she only charges $4 a piece for these. I don't know how she does it for that. I mean, by the time you buy your dishcloth, your yarn, and you take your time to crochet that, it seems like she would have a lot more into it. So I would have gladly gave her five, but she had tons of them, all different kinds, and I should have got more. It would have made a nice gift, some of them. So I just love it. Okay. I have a cobalt blue collection. And right now it's in my windowsill in my kitchen, so when I wash dishes, I can look at the sun shining on it. And I got this Philips Milk of Magnesia bottle, and it's the cobalt blue. I did give $4.99 for it, but I didn't have one this size. I have a larger one. And on the bottom, it says Philips Milk of Magnesia, made in the USA. And I thought it was just such a cute size. You can put little florals in it or just use it like it is. I am going to wash it. It's a little dirty on the inside, so I'm going to polish it up a little bit. So I got that. Then I got this Vic Sav bottle. It's a little jar, glass jar, and it is cobalt blue. And it actually has the metal lid on it. And I couldn't pass it up. It was only $3.99. So, I got that for my collection. It's about two and a half inches tall, and I think it'll be so pretty up there in the windowsill. Couldn't pass it up, y'all. Then, the deal of the day. I got this rose plate for a dollar. And I don't know why they were selling it for a, just a dollar. This is a Franklin Mint porcelain plate from 1991 and it's called the majesty of roses and y'all know i love some roses i love the fragrance i love roses and flowers so i could not pass this up it's got some wine colored roses on it and some pink ones and cream ones and pink is my favorite color and for a dollar i was like <laughs> jump in my cart you know and that's what the back looks like. And it even come with a hanger. The hanger was worth more than a dollar. So I'm not sure if I'll put this on an easel or if I will hang it on the wall. But you can bet I'm going to use it. I've got to get this sticker off. And so far, it's coming off pretty easy. I'm just hoping it don't pull the paint off. 
because sometimes it might do that. But you know, if it pulls a little bit of it off, that'll be okay. So I like sometimes a little imperfection in my decor. The next thing I got was this little tiny cobalt blue bottle. And I have no idea what came in this. I have a suspicion that perfume came in it. And maybe it was the Evening in Paris perfume that was so popular in the 40s and 50s. So it's tiny. It's about two and a half inches tall. And I love it. I'm going to have to do some research on it. This was $4.95, a little pricey. Uh, and it's got just a small bottle on it for the description. So I'm going to do some research and see what kind this is. But this will look so cute in my windowsill. Now that's all I got from the flea market. Then from a yard sale, what did I do with that thing? Here it is. From a yard sale, I got this vase. It's got two holes in the top. It's real thin glass, and I give a quarter for it. It's got little feet on the bottom, and it's filthy. Dirt don't bother me. It, You know, I can clean it up. But you can put your propagations in this, like your cuttings off of your house plants, and you can root them. And I think this is what that's for. So I'm going to clean it up. And for a quarter, I could not pass it up. I'm going to cut some philodendron or some of that and root that, and I think it would be real pretty. Okay, the clearance at Walmart. They had a lot of toys on clearance, summer toys, and I got these toss and catch games for $2. They were regular, $5 a piece. You get two of the mitts, which is this thing, two of them, and a ball. This is like Velcro in here, and this ball is like the fuzzy stuff. I don't know how to describe it. The fuzzy stuff. And they can throw it back and forth and it sticks to the mitts. So I got two of those for my grandchildren. <coughs> Y'all forgive me. <coughs> for coughing like that. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have to get me something to drink. But I got two of them to keep here at my house for my grandchildren. And this will keep them occupied for about 10 minutes. <laughs> but I got two. I should have got another one, but, you know, you can only buy so much. So, I got two of those to keep here at my house. Now, a little show and tell. Do y'all remember when I showed you this vase? back a couple of months ago that my husband picked up at a yard sale for two dollars and it was so dirty it's got feet on it and it's crystal and for two dollars he knew it would be pretty once i cleaned it and it is it is sparkling it is just beautiful it's about this big about as big as my head a little smaller I washed it up, and I've got this sitting in the middle of my coffee table in my living room. I bought these little artificial florals from Walmart on a clearance rack for a quarter apiece. And they're a peach rose with this little light pink to the side and a little eucalyptus. So I just dropped it in there. I got two of them, so I got 50 cents in the floral, $2 in the vase. And I thought it was so pretty. It looks beautiful on my coffee table. I have a round coffee table, and this looks so pretty for summer. So I wanted to show you that, how it cleaned up, because it was so dirty, you just couldn't appreciate it. I have one more thing to show you. This was from a Timu haul I did back in the spring. And these are little vases that swing on a little metal bar here. And they're for propagations, too. We never called them propagations. We called it rooting. You cut off a piece of a house plant, stick it in water, and it roots. But anyway, they call it propagations now. So <laughs> this is for propagations. But I put, an, I took apart a floral stem, and I'm not sure if I got it from Walmart for a dollar or from Dollar Tree for a dollar and a quarter. But these are little carnations. 
and they look real. I have this on the end of a counter in my kitchen, and people that come in think this is real carnations in the little vases. And it made a pretty display for my kitchen. And I just think it's lovely. And I wanted to show that to you. And I may, it's a little dusty, y'all. I have a problem with housework. But I get it done. I get it done. But uh, sometimes I have a little problem keeping up. I may put some cuttings in this later on. But for right now, I'm going to have these little carnations in there. So I give $9.99 for this uh, on Timu. I've only done one Timu order and I was okay with it. I was okay with it. So I may order from them in the future. I don't know. I don't know. But that's what I wanted to show you. I don't have anything else to show you. <laughs> Except this. <laughs> Clothes to fold. So, and that's my coffee bar. Did I show y'all that? I don't show y'all that coffee bar. Well, anyway, <laughs> I'm glad you joined me tonight. Please give me a thumbs up. If you like this video, it helps the algorithm get out to more people, and it helps my family. And talk to me in the comments. I want to hear from you. And if you will, subscribe. Join the Tammy House family. And that's all I got. I love y'all, and God bless you, and have a great weekend. Bye.